Me too. Um, what made me decide to go into go into voice acting? Yeah. Um, most people that do this for a living don't decide they are going to be a voice actor. Um, I think it's a misconception a lot of people have about what we do for a living. Um, most of us are actors, and that's it. I'm an actor, whether I'm working on a commercial or doing a stand-up comedy act or whether I'm doing this. Um, so much of being a professional performer is finding out where your fit is and finding out what works for you. Um, there are people that sound, have the sexiest voices on earth, but like when you meet them you're like, ah, yeah, and it's not that that's bad, it's just that, it's not you know, pictures. I will never play Romeo in Romeo and Juliet. I've got a strange voice and I'm short and kind of chubby and like, and that's fine with me, but voice acting is for people with weird range and the ability to express something with just a simple sound. The, the um, alteration of the voice. Yeah, yeah. Or like, it, like Johnny Bosch can sound like he's getting beat up better than anybody I know. I mean, I've listened to him do fighting reaction sound and get, getting his butt kicked, and he got it right the first time. And that's not always the easiest sound to make. You know, the getting punched in the stomach and kicked in the head and boom, 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 and he can make it totally believable. You would think he's really getting hurt. Um, do you have any tips or suggestions for people who want to go into this? Like, I know drama class it. is a very good good way to do it. I did that readers adaptation theater yeah. a lot and a lot of improv. And you know, readers theater is as close to, within theater, there are two things that you get into that are close to what we do. Readers theater or adaptation theater and improv. Yeah. Because one of the things, oh, did it? Did it? I, oh, hey. Okay. One of the things that we have to be able to do is read out loud well, expressively, because we never see the scripts before we walk in the door most of the time. So the day we record is our first time seeing that information. So if you're not good on your feet reading and you're not good on improv, yeah. you kind of get it you might know, not thrown be into the wolves. Yeah. It might not be your niche, but. And we're about to end. Hang on. Boom.